making up my Cajun blackening seasoning recipe today for some red beans and rice that I'm making. And this is a serious gift I'm giving you. It's good for pork. You can bake, grill, or barbecue with it. Uh, beef steaks, you can do those as well. Any kind of beef on the grill or barbecue in the oven. Chicken, fried, baked, or grilled. Fish or shrimp, of course, smoked, grilled. You can use it for your uh, fried mix as well, even vegetable. And I'll give you a few quick recipes, but let's make our mix. Three tablespoons of salt, two teaspoons garlic powder, one tablespoon plus two teaspoons paprika, one teaspoon black pepper, one teaspoon onion powder, one and one quarter teaspoons oregano, one and one quarter teaspoons thyme, one teaspoon basil, one tablespoon chili powder. Now you're going to put all this in a jar, shake it aggressively, and this is your product. What can you do with it? Well, first you can make fried chicken that'll put the chicken joints out of business. Fried chicken. Half a cup of flour, two teaspoons cornstarch, one level tablespoon of your seasoning mix. And it'll be that famous chicken. I can't name it, but you know what it is. Bake chicken. Just sprinkle it on and bake it your regular old way. Steak. Sprinkle it on, grill it, broil it, bake it, or for the absolute best, add a pat of butter and pan fry it to your likeness. Well, we'll tackle red beans and rice in an upcoming video, but for now, you got a dynamite, Cajun, spice mix. And I hope you enjoy all the things that you can do with it, because you can do a lot. Happy eating!